my face looks all red from the Christmas tree and I was scratching my face. Yeah. Um, it's like itches in here. I'm in a really bad house, so lay off me with the way I look. Um, clearly they're going to wage war on me. They want me destitute in abject poverty. Uh, that's obvious. Fucking every way they do that. Um, I am beside myself, but I wanted to get my website set up. And I never had any intention. This is funny that I always wanted to do this and I did not see this part of my life ever. But like, I've wanted to do this since I was younger. Um, like free literature, punk rock, anarcho stuff, okay? I can't, I can't get into it right now. I'm just not in the right house for that. Um, mixed with video, mixed with media. And then like maybe there'd be like a website for my cooking the separate website uh, and then just take it from there, okay? I want to keep some things just organized. And I guess if money is involved and these are all mob run, that's how I like to call it in a nutshell, and the mob hates Heidi, I got to find other ways to like, yeah, set up your own website. I wanted to do that anyways, because I'm able to get people to read. And I'm grateful that Ra gave me that gift. And when I can do more editing and cooler stuff and graphics and all this stuff, I don't want to elaborate because I'm just not capable of it right now. Um, it'll draw more. Oh, it's going to be great. I always knew that. And it's intended to be free. That's the point. And some of it, sure, make capital. That will be the way to... See, I can't even talk anymore. I know it's not my fault. Anyways, the basic function of it is free. That's the whole point. But there'll be some places if someone wants to buy something, okay? I do plan on publishing. I don't believe any of these publishers in the United States will even publish me. No, I'm serious. And I didn't, I didn't ever even plan, that's so funny because when I was like turning 30, I, I started really making some ideas about this. Or I, that's not the right word, but this is the only words I have right now. Uh, I already looked into self-publishing like, fuck, 15 years ago. And I was going to do it off my website. That's fucking weird. I saw that one, huh? I bet I did. I can't hardly like um, make sentences out. I'm tired and I'm in a really bad house. But I'm hanging in there. But look, if this is going to be the game, it's to me, I'm not, it's, it's to me what I already knew when I was like 30, 29, 28, 27. I never intended my writing or any of the videos that came, which is part of the media that I wanted to do anyways, to make profit from it. So, all right, YouTube, ban against me. You're meddling with shit that's evidence in murder trials, just like Twitter, That that's why they're doing it. That's why they're doing it. Because it goes to the White House, it's everything. It goes to Harris, goes to all these uh, tweaker uh, politicians. They're really freaking out. This house does. It's not my problem, man. You need to have a, a mob war. You need to start really holding yourselves a, a little bit more accountable and stop blaming the cops and coming after every last cop in the world. My ears itching here. Everything itches. I got to get out of here. I know that. Okay. Um, but like, it's just so clear now, you know, some things are just clear. You don't need to get green lights. This, this is not going to be something that I ventured looking to make capital off of. No. And I'll put my heart and soul and like a lot of my time into it. Not all my time. I want to have a life too. But it's something I am to do. And I've always known that. So that's fine. Uh, that one I put up is, I can't remember the name right now. That's going to be the new, see how that goes. And I'll go from there if there's a problem with it. You know, just like something I don't like or whatever. I don't think I'll have organized crime issues with that one that I put up.
and there, there's no capital that I'm seeking to make and yeah I will self-publish and so I'll go with my websites and so on and so forth I can't get into it too much right now I'm, I'll, I'll find that I'm getting frustrated if I try I'm just too fucked up in this house but um I the cooking is something that I, I decided to do because I've been watching them for so long I thought well just do it you can do that and that might be separate and that's intended to be free too like I'm not a money person um, I know when I publish I will make revenue off my book sales okay and a lot of the stuff that I want to do with my books there's media there's cool stuff I'm going to do but I got to get away from these dust pots and I got to have a life again and I can do it with the um, education I have I would like to maybe someday get a bachelor's but I'm just going to put that on the back burner um I have an education thank god I have an associate's right I don't count the six credits the six credits were robbed from me by the New York mob Um, but that will be undoubtable revenue and I'm not a person that needs to have millions of dollars I don't need that and I can't really see the forest through the trees right now all I know is that I need to um, recuperate after I leave here and then as I'm healing from the trauma that I experienced in Washington, D.C., it's not just about me, but I think an adult knows that. The trauma I experienced is because they're waging war on the rest of the fucking world from D.C. And they're trying to commit genocide, which they are actually pulling off through COVID. But they, they had much grander plans from here. So I am not surprised that I'm going through what I'm going through. And no, I'm going to have to recover when I leave from what they did to me because I fought them tooth and nail. Okay? So, and that's not why I expect to have book sales. It's because my writing's really great and fun to read. So that's why people like to read it. And yeah, a little bit, not too much, but a little bit. You want to maybe spend five bucks on the book or something. It's not going to be too much. But, um, and then that will be mixed in with some cool media stuff that I need to get out of here to really elaborate on. I'm just not doing it. Can't. I'm not, I don't have the capacity in here to do it. So I'm all right. I feel good about where my life will go as far as that. And the cooking is something, sorry, my ear itches in here because I'm always plugging them. It's serious business, this city. Okay, but as far as the cooking goes, this is something that I didn't foresee because I was gonna get that JD. I was gonna do this and that, right? But I didn't see the, I didn't foresee the dust pots. I've um, spoken about that before. So after all this four years almost of just nonstop trauma and the kitchen sink being thrown at me because I dissented and I did everything I could to stop them from killing a lot of people. We, I did. It was a group effort, but I, I played a role in that. I found that one of the ways to recoup is I just want to focus on culinary. It's weird. It's not weird. The action and activity of that, no, it would make sense. But it's weird to me that that's where my life ended up. Doing the same thing I did when I was young. What? I just, I don't want to... As again, I can't see the forest through the trees, so I can't really analyze it right now. But I, I think, at least right now, that's where I want to put my my thoughts towards. We'll see what happens. You know, life will show you and do things for you that you don't foresee, just like the situation I'm in now. But, um, look, I don't need this YouTube and this Twitter and this bullshit and, um, They would just take it from there and I'm going to keep giving my life to Ra, you know, God, Ra, um, San Miguel, 
and these despots and this organized crime that run all these social medias. I guess if they want to stop the paper production, are they going to go that far? I, I don't know. They're desperate, right? They're not even going to be in power that long, okay? And then I'm being kind of cynical. They're going to stop the paper production of my books? I am concerned, but I know there's really good people out there that will help me if it's a big battle to get my count that they tried to uh, disappear. Because all that to anybody who is an author is literature to me that is, I can't explain it, but it's, I need that. I'm not saying I'm publishing it raw like that, but I need all that. And they're trying to take and take and take everything fucking from me and I, I panic. They already took my JD, they already took my bachelor's, they already took my home, and they're taking that, and they're taking this, and taking that, and taking this. They already took my couch and my bed and everything. Fuck, man, I'm not kidding. Stop taking from me, you motherfuckers. They're gonna be, they're gonna be, they're gonna be put to a stop because this shit's gone too far. They spread COVID, they're taking people's lives. This is what they want. And I gotta keep my head on my shoulders. Heidi, they're neo-Nazis. This is why you're on earth. You stopped their fucking genocide. I'm one of the people who did, and I know that. And so I'm getting brutalized for it. And that is how it feels. And it is what they're doing. But I just got to keep my head on my shoulders. It's not going to last forever. I will live through this. Millions of other people will live through this too. They will be taken out of power. You can not wage war and try to kill all these other ethnic people. No. Or the caliphate. So you can be Al-Qaeda king. No. No. All right. God bless America. Say goodbye.